Good morning. Thank you very much for allowing me to interview you. Would you mind telling me what type of procedure you had done recently? Actually, I think it's classified as a rotor rooter, or that was my understanding. And um, basically, it was the removal of part of the prostate in order to clear up the channel for a urination. Uh, my systems had gotten, or my bladder, it had gotten so bad that I actually ended up in emergency because I was unable to urinate. Um, since coming to you and having you do the surgery on me, it's completely relieved all stress and strain. Uh, it's removed me getting up every one to two hours during the night to, at the most, I get up now as a one hour, or once a night, excuse me. Um, your patient care, both from your office and yourself, and uh, the care you put towards the family is absolutely unbelievable. Um, you are somebody I would recommend to other patients and actually uh, would be positive to be out there and influencing others. I've, I believe I've actually had a friend that's already come to you based on that same scenario as uh, just your patient care and stuff. So I'd like to thank you for the effort you and your office put forth. Well, well thank you very much for that. I was, I was asking more to, about your experience with the, uh, with the uh, procedure. Um, can you tell me how that has changed your quality of life? Oh, drastically. Um, I used to need to uh, stay fairly close to a bathroom. The longest I used to be able to go is about an hour, hour and a half before running to the bathroom. Uh, now it's basically, it, it's funny, you said think of it when you were 18. It's very similar to that is um, I'm able to hold it. Uh, if the urge comes, I can control it. I can wait until the most convenient time. But it's not always a requirement. Uh, the flow has drastically increased. It's made it very easy. Uh, it's taken a lot of stress both off me and the uh, health situation in regards to it. So, How were you treated with uh, medication uh, prior to the surgery? Um, prior to the surgery, the medications that were recommended to me is I was given two medications by the hospital. Um, I believe one was to uh, reduce the uh, prostate sizing and stuff, and the other was to uh, release or uh, control the, the discomfort. Um, immediately after the surgery, I was able to stop both of them and actually have not had to have any medication in regards to uh, the prostate since then. And any problems with control of your urine after the procedure? No. Uh, well, it took probably about a couple weeks. Uh, in the very beginning, there was a, um, an urge to constantly go, very similar to what my body had already trained it to do. And then um, over time, that uh, has completely went away. Um, I no longer feel a continuous urge or a, uh, the need to. And also now it's just basically when I feel I have a full bladder, I'm able to go and take care of the situation. And well, that sounds wonderful. And uh, any trouble with the erections? Uh, none. Uh, the only difference is, is um, with sexual intercourse, you no longer, I no longer have an outgoing flow. Uh, my understanding is, is based on the surgery. I still have the erection. I still have the same feeling and everything. I just no longer uh, ejaculate. Correct. So the erections are still there. The orgasm still exists. It's just that nothing comes out. That is correct. Okay. Some people would say that is a plus. <laughs> <laughs> uh, my wife would probably agree with that. <laughs> well, very good. Well, thank you so much for uh, allowing me to interview you. Would you mind if I share this uh, video with those who may be interested in this procedure? No, not at all. Okay, thank you so much. Thank you.